folks, how's it going? We're checking out Boar Rat Part 2. I'm not saying that full title. Hopefully you guys had a fantastic day. I really enjoyed the first Boar Rat. I thought it was fantastic. Very funny. I checked out the trailer from this movie and I enjoyed the trailer. Just overall excited about seeing this movie. The reviews are mixed with this movie though. The first movie, people either said they hated the whole Boar Rat character. They, it was burnt out. They didn't even want to see the movie because people kept imitating the character so they didn't even care to see it. Or some people just don't like Sasha in general. They don't, they don't think his stuff is funny. For the most part, people seem to like Sasha and everything he does and they think he's really funny. It's like that um, love him or hate him kind of thing. I believe this is the first time that I have people who are fans of Borat, the clips he's done, Sasha stuff in general, that weren't fans of this movie. They didn't think it was good. They thought it was too little too late. There was too big of a gap between the movies and it was kind of like regurgitated stuff from the previous one with a few new things flaked in. I heard that as well. But me, like all the movies, I try to go in as clean as possible. I did see the trailer for this, so it's not completely clean. I do have some expectations because Sasha's really funny. I've enjoyed all the Borat stuff before. So I am going to go into this with some expectations but they're not through the roof i just expect to enjoy it because i like sasha stuff and pretty sure it's gonna be funny someone messaged me and said it was worth the wait that it was great that he waited to do part two because the climate of things are just right with everything that's going on in the states during the time he was recording this it was perfect it set the perfect stage for another borat movie and that's why they appreciated it so yeah man like i said usually with the borat stuff it's you love them or you hate them this one has some original fans that said they didn't like it and and some that said they loved it so we're gonna see going into it man but it's sasha pretty fun I'm not sure what he can do in this movie that's gonna disappoint me. Let's just see what happens and jump into it, folks. Yuck Shumash. My name is Borat. My wife is nice. Not. But how I end up like this? 14 years ago, I released a movie film which was great success in USA. But Kazakhstan becoming laughing stocks around the world. Our exports of potassium and pubis plummet. Many broke. He explained that while I was in Gulag, USNA was ruined by an evil man who stood against all American values. His name? Barack Obama. <laughs> this led to other Africans oh, becoming shit. political leaders. <laughs> no! A magnificent Bogus. new premier named McDonald Trump rose to power and made america great again he also became buddies with tough guy leaders across the world i got to america <laughs> it was time for me to return to Yankee land Weird to save my people. You can ask Google questions and it'll He's so annoying. I can make it typings? Yes. Restaurants near me. Mm -hmm. Maybe I look for food that I like to eat. And for dessert, um... <laughs> what else? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh this no! No, this is probably the way you're looking for. Oh, you yeah. Can I make borrowings this for one moment? Sure. I need to go uh, to that. <laughs> oh, you stay here. Uh, bless him. <laughs> To find out so that Johnny stupid. the Monkey would be delivered in three <laughs> hours' time. I was excited. My name is John Chevrolet. Oh, nice no. I want you Do to a make a hot denim. Sea out of this Nazi. <laughs> you want to see the hair? I would like to see Jesus. her hair, yes. To... No, no, my God. <laughs> I have the uh, um, idea of a hair. No. Okay. This one. Nice one. This is Dude, actually stop. a gentleman. <laughs> this is a male? Yes, sir. <laughs> 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 what a dog the body hunter. Okay, so we're going to do a spray tan today. How dark is she wanting to go? What color is best for a racist family? <laughs> <laughs> I would stay right here. 
I wouldn't go any darker than a six or a seven. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Okay. Where is the no means yes section? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> At least you got a laugh out of her. I have a baby inside me, mm -hmm. and I want to take it out of me. No. No, please. Right. I mean, you oh my God. No, we cannot. That's not what we do here. And why not? It's already dead. It's not living. No, it is living right now. Is this out of control? It's it has a heartbeat right now. I don't think so. It is a living, <laughs> breathing life that God has created. Oh, I don't no. think he's breathing. We, we can show you that it's breathing. It hurts uh, my stomach. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. And it will hurt my asshole. <laughs> if it come out. Yes, because the, the, no. arm, the arm like this. I feel bad because I was the one who put the baby in her. <laughs> you don't need to feel bad. I was just oh, trying shit. to give my daughter pleasure, and the next thing I know, there is a baby inside her. <laughs> you keep calling Yes. Okay. Is he your father? Yes. Do uh, stop. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to give my daughter a treat. I understand. Oh, I, shit. I, I, don't need to hear was... any, I don't need to hear any more of that. I understand. She's this pastor is going to lose that, it. That, that but look at that face. I understand. How could I not give it I to her? Would I, you have not given it to her? I understand. Listen, I, it really, that... When he treat me, he said this will be our little secret. Yeah, <laughs> this is why I do it here behind the dumpster. So no, no. <laughs> now that you know that I am no. her father, can we take it out now, Dude. please? God is the one who created life, <laughs> and God doesn't make accidents. Dude, are you serious? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, oh. Anything ass beat. No. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Control. They're out of control. <laughs> oh no, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I gotta shake this off. I'm gonna like miss something crazy. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. <laughs> I'm Stephen Miller. Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> oh my god, please show a black person. I needed to get Tutar to pants. The only man <laughs> that Trump it. would trust. No. But who does pants trust? I knew the disguise I had to use. Did I show a black person I just missed it? That would be great to see your face. I decide to take my own life. Since I did not have money to buy a gun, I went to the nearest synagogue to wait for the next mass shooting. <laughs> Disguised as a typical Dude, Jew. stop. <laughs> oh, this dude needs his butt beat. Very nice weather uh, we have been controlling. <laughs> you are Jewish? Um, oh, dude. Yes. No, you are not Jewish. <laughs> Listen, don't, don't look care. at Doris. 
Does she have a long nose? A little bit bigger than yours. <laughs> so we are normal. This is the stupid. Be like you. It's a sweet okay, lady. Use your venom on me and finish me. I have very <laughs> depressed. Can I give you a Use your hug? venom on me. Don't, don't. Don't kill me. <laughs> Let me give you a kiss. Don't kill me. <laughs> you see, I give you a kiss and you are still alive. Yeah. Lucky for me. I was taken in by two of America's greatest scientists. <laughs> killing some of the virus. Stop, dude. No, you can't see the virus. No, it's still there. This will kill the virus. Yes, I'm stuck in the middle with you. And I'm wondering what it is you do. It's so hard. He's some patient dudes, man. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> They are so patient. This is for Washington. Oh my gosh. Are we going to inject them with the Wuhan flu? Or chop them up like the Saudis do? Okay, let's hear it. Who wants to inject them with the Wuhan flu? Who wants to chop them up like the Saudis do? What we're going to do? Thank you so much. Okay, I will go. Okay. Uh, one last thing. Will you be my new black wife? <laughs> no, sir, I cannot be your new black wife. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. He completely ruined that sweet exchange. <laughs> this dude is out of control. Some nice people in this movie, man. Oh, my Pride God. Pride exports the club misogynist. So we now traffic grooms. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> my iPhone 4 is hotspot. We are part of the global community, influencing elections around the world. <laughs> Kazakhstan now is of COVID safe fashion. Oh shit. We <laughs> oh, they, they are too much, dude. <laughs> oh, God bless him. <laughs> this is so stupid. Oh, this movie was insane. It was goofy. I like the first one more, but I did really enjoy this one, man. I don't know all the rules and regulations when it comes to the stuff they do. I'm pretty sure everybody, probably with the exception of public figures, have to sign off saying it is okay to use their face in the in the movies. That's why they showed a decent amount of people blurred out. I'm not sure if they know how they're gonna be portrayed before it ends. Probably hear that hey, I'm gonna be in the movie, so I'm down with whatever. The guys who let him come home with them, those are some nice guys. There's some crazy like conspiracy theory stuff, but there's some nice guys. They're actually trying to help out a complete stranger, find his daughter and everything, dude. And they actually tried they were patient with this dude dancing around with dildo underwear and stuff on the house he left her at with the lady she was very nice trying to give the girl a few words of wisdom and stuff and then also trying to convince him to go get his daughter back and not um, make her date an older man it's wild to me even though he's a politician and a public figure the whole scene with him on the bed digging around in his underwear and stuff like that Giuliani I'm surprised they were able to keep that in there because it looks like he was prepping his stuff for a blowjob you know he's removing his mic and stuff that's what it looked like it's just wild man I have to say my favorite scene was the period scene dude that was ridiculous that was hard to watch it was cringy it was gross it was hilarious it just was it was fantastic dude i had a headache laughing at that scene and i couldn't stop thinking about it going into the next scenes that's the bad part we watched in these movies it happened to me with in betweeners when he was hitting the face at her at the swimming pool dude i could barely like pay attention to the next scene because i kept laughing at that everybody getting out of the pool him like you know looking around almost like a lost child it was just crazy that girl i have to look up her name she's a great actress man she's just as bold as he is in regards to, like mess with people and 
not being, you know, not bad an eye. That takes a lot to be able to do that type of stuff. Be annoying and weird and all that without, you know, bad an eye. She did a really good job with it. I'm not sure if she's ever been anything else and I just didn't notice it. If she hasn't been anything else besides this, and this is like her debut film or whatever, hopefully she gets more roles from this because she did a really, really good job. That was a really good twist with the whole thing, him spreading the virus and stuff around. Because let's say when they started this film, it was just starting. Like they recorded a part where I'm talking about only 15 cases, the American people were fine, but things blow up, yada, yada, yada. We we're prepared for it, even though we weren't. Then also, let's not forget all the people who were doing whatever he wanted as long as they got paid, you know? All the stuff he said he was going to do in regards to about his cage and stuff for his daughter, this dude didn't, like, did not care. Like, whatever you want to buy, dude, as long as you pay for it and leave, I don't care what you do with it. The guy who told him, when he said, no, the box back shut, he's like, give me my money, I don't care. The lady writing, like, the anti-Semitic stuff on the cake, give me my money, I don't care. <laughs> hand it over i don't care what you say do the pastor saying fantastic that was hilarious jesus in the end with the pastor saying only god can create life so god created and allowed it so it doesn't matter or something like that he said like yo you're saying that she should still have a child that she conceived sleep with her dad <laughs> oh no god has a reason for it <laughs> And we give these people a lot of credit for being, you know, being good people, maintaining their composure, collecting the funds, uh, not questioning a lot of his behavior. But I have to remember he had a camera crew with him. Camera was there the entire time. So people adjust their behavior based on if they think somebody's watching or not. So that has something to do with it too. Like somebody actually having the camera crew and stuff like that can definitely impact their behavior. Unless the camera's hidden. The hidden camera's much better now, but I highly doubt it. Pretty sure he had a camera guy with him the entire time and a sound guy the entire time. And I'm not sure how he explained it to him. Like it's just a documentary. So people adjust their behavior accordingly. Who knows? This just popped in my head now the dad saying that he would pay $500 for her and the daughter being disgusted. That was fantastic. <laughs> Like, why don't you even answer that, you gross bastard? All right, folks, man, make sure you guys tell me what you think. I enjoyed this movie. I thought it was hilarious. It was very goofy. That is it, folks. That is all for this one. Hopefully, you guys are happy, safe, and healthy. I'll see you in the next one. Later.